Hello, everyone. Uh, I'm gonna be honest. I was about to play more Genshin, and then I realized I would not be able to pad two and a half hours of content out of it, so I just kind of gave up on that idea. And now we're gonna do Spectrum's Origins. And you're gonna like it. Hopefully. Maybe. Genshin Impact is content? I know, right? I'm gonna turn up my mic very slightly. By an entire decibel. Hello, Hachiko. How's it going? Uh, oh, good. Dolphin has an update. Uh, update after closing Dolphin. There we go. Okay. Now we pause the music. Hopping in until you went live. I'm glad you did. I thought it was just 1,000 sided die simulator. I mean, it really is. Genshin really is just like. A physical representation of a thousand-sided die that isn't a thousand-sided die. Nine plus ten wood, is it? Uh, math. You're giving me math. Alright. Give me the good shit. Yeah. Oh yeah, we made it all the way to Anahot last time. I forgot about that. Get owned, Cosmo Key. I know exactly what to say in all scenarios. Also, I uh, reunified my uh, my stream notifications, so now they all use uh, Spectrobe sound effects again instead of all being fucking like different. All right. Oh, it's this one. Who's ready for my control scheme to suddenly not work again? Uh, button. Faulty controls, Pog Champ. Yeah, basically. All right. Where's the arbitrary battle? It's over here. Oh, I still have my finger on my rotate camera key button on my Wii remote that is physical and exists. All right. Okay, let's go. Go. Over there. Uh, monkey. I'm here to cease to care because life is heck. You know what? Sometimes you just need that. Wait. Chesmond is actually stronger. Than Funny Monkey. That's not Chesmond. Yes, it is. Go, Chesmond! Our boy Chesmond, coming in clutch. Remember him? Come on. Come on, Chesmond. Alright. Please work. Yeah! What the hell? the hell? What? Hello? Hello? Why am I walking forward? Okay. I figured it out. I figured it out. It's okay. Crimson I... Liar, thank you very much for following while I mash buttons. I've never actually seen this game, I'm surprised. Chadsmond? Yeah, basically. Look at him go! Look at him sweep! Also, wait a minute, how did he use super? He's not level 40. Wait a minute. I don't know if anyone else noticed, but something really fucking weird just happened. Yeah, what the hell just happened? Um... That explains why he didn't do his animation, I guess. But anyways, it's, it's nice to see you in here, Crimson Liar. Special animation was the same as his normal attack. Yeah, I don't. What the hell? That's a new one. All right, button. My theory is that his special was charged before he evolved. Oh yeah, probably. Oh boy, do I get to do another one on the way back? No, thank God. <laughs> he just wanted to prove how much better he was than everyone else. 
That's my theory from my heart. You know what? I accept it. We all know that Chesmond is the true champion. What was that? Oh boy, it's Neil. Yeah. Alright. Do I have... Damn it! I'm going all the way back. Fuck that. Nope. I think his name is Chesman. That's just a hop, a skip, and a jump away from Chad. Oh, yeah. The game doesn't think to clear that when you evolve? Huh. We'll have to test that on, like, hardware. Even though this is real legal hardware smile. Um. God. I am going to swap one of my children so I can get that weapon, because God knows I'm not leaving it behind. Alright. Cute. Okay. Oh. Oh, yeah. Priest. Momentum. Nova. Fucking. Trappa. Perp. That's not grass. Oh, yeah! It's Pepe! <laughs> Alright, we're bringing in Pepe. Uh, who do we swap out, though? Different species of spectrum might be able to do fun things with that. Attack values are different from much everything, so it would just be a matter of how they behave when they use placeholder data. Huh. Seems like our Spectrum's modding is about to get a little bit more content. Um. Oh, this is a good question. What do I replace with Pepe? Oh, good. Fire alarm. This always happens when my mom cooks chicken. Literally fucking always. Without fail, my mom always sets off the fire alarm when she cooks chicken. I don't know how or why. Okay, we're gonna swap out the knife. This happens whenever we cook anything on the stovetop. You know what, that's fair. But, like, she cooks, like, all kinds of other meat. It only happens with fucking... It only happens with chicken. She only sets off the fire alarm with chicken. And I don't understand how. <laughs> Alright. Give me the Pepe. Oh, that's a lovely walking noise. That won't get annoying very quickly. How does she cook it? Does she pan fry it? Yeah, I'm mostly sure she uses a pan. Go. Go, Pepe. Jingle at me. Sometimes I forget that, that the Pepe line is, uh, uh, grass. Or plant, or whatever. Whatever the game wants to call it. Speaking of, there's the Pepe sword! Maybe why if it heats too high, you'll choke to death. Ah. Pepe sword, baby! Yeah! <laughs> I did not get the frame-perfect pet, so I am a disgrace to my entire family. Oh. Gary J would be ashamed of me. Uh, alright. Now for more of the actual dungeon. God. I bet you guys can't wait for me to unlock the, the card input machine. We're just gonna spend like a good half hour inputting oh. everything. That'll be content, right? Oh, look at that corner. I'll take those. Uh, is there a battle in here? No. Yes, I lied. Cat girl Gina Pog champ. Yeah. Oh, good. A flying, a flying one. Fuck off. Wait, what? I can just do this? Again! <laughs> I think it, I don't know what it is. It, did, is it because I used Geo to rename him maybe? Uh, yes, this is Gina. 
This is Gina on screen. Uh, the giant fucking cactus dragon we're using to murder everything in the, me the immediate vicinity is Chessman. He is the VIP and the MVP and all the letters of the alphabet you want him to be. I doubt it. I don't know. That's really like the only reason I can think of. I don't know, I just got here. No, that's completely fair, I understand. <laughs> After all, I haven't streamed this in like a month. Uh, again, I, I, I said this earlier, but I was planning on streaming Genshin Impact, but then I realized I uh, wouldn't get two and a half hours of content out of it, so I just didn't. Uh, oh yeah, this puzzle. Uh, let's see if I remember how to do it. Let's see if I remember. There is not a switch for... Oh wait, no, this is easy. Yeah. <laughs> Mmm, babby game puzzles, my favorite. Oh, yeah. Look at how hard that was. I just noticed pixel characters saying stuff on screen. Yeah, that's uh, stream avatars. Uh, if you follow the channel, you can select a bunch of them. Yeah, there are generations 1 through 4 of Pokemon. All of the legendaries are, I believe, 100, 100 bits or $1. I know a friend that has the same kind of like setup, but he has the legendaries for five dollars. However, I know you don't want to spend that much money on me, <laughs> or at all. So, if you subscribe to the channel, you get Absol. Just because I'm extremely biased toward Absol. Uh, I found the ruined entrance. Oh lord. Yes, Neil likes to fall into things. That's his shtick. If you go over there, Kitakai. Everyone should be, honestly. I'm biased toward Guard of War and Absol. Oh, absolutely. Guard of War... I'm surprised... Like, Absol is in, like, a weird position where it's, like, a Pokemon everyone loves, but no one really talks about. Milotic? Oh, yeah, Milotic's also good. At least they made Phoebus easier to, like, acquire in Sword and Shield. I can't wait for fucking Crown Tundra. That comes out in less than a week now. You bet your ass I am streaming that. Next Thursday, I am streaming Crown Tundra. Thursday and or Friday. I can't remember which day it comes out. Actually, hold on. Let me check my calendar. Just while this cutscene's playing. Uh, it is Thursday. Okay. So on Thursday, I'm totally streaming Crown Tundra. Uh... Open it up, can direct surprise egg, not clickbait, it was alive. Also, I haven't had the money for new Pokemon since black and white, rip. Honestly, that's a good stopping point. Like, literally everyone and their dog says this, but Pokemon kind of dropped off as soon as it hit 3D. Uh, like, it hasn't been bad, it's just been kind of bland. As was like Lucario without any promotional material or marketing. It had a role in Jirachi Wishmaker! X and Y were bad. Yeah, they were just... They were the worst example. The Dynamax thing is a little strange. Dynamax is... Honestly, probably the worst out of the three 3D gimmicks. Good speedrun, though. Yeah. What happened? Can we talk about painting now? Yeah! Something's in this desert that we can use. Thank God under a rocky arch. I know where that thing is. Oh, look. Goons. We're out, of, we're out of ideas, they say, as the designer frankly scrolls the size bar up. Yeah, basically. Dynamax is mechanically pretty sick and doubles, and to be honest, generally more appealing to me than Z-moves. Yeah, I wish, I wish that Megas, I wish that Megas were in. God. Uh, here's a fun fact about how Pokemon is made. Ever since Diamond and Pearl, instead of redoing oh, excuse me, the item database for every single game, they just kept updating on the existing one. So every item from Diamond Pearl Diamond and Pearl onward is at least in the files of the game of Sword and Shield. 
So, like, if they needed to, they could just, like, pull things back. If they really, really needed to. Jirachi, which make it the most bestest Pokemon movie everyone's ever watched. Pokemon definitely needs a competitor. You're looking at one from 2007 to 2009. <laughs> Where else would we find one of those? Hmm, I don't know. I see we're talking about Pokemon. Yeah. We're talking about how underwhelming the 3D ones are. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah. Okay, feel go. the frames. Feel the rhythm, feel the rhyme. Go, go Chesman! Oi. Go, Chesman! Kick his ass! Kick his ass, Chesman! Go, 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 go! I love them poker mobs, yeah. Uh, and now this is the part where- This is the part of the stream where I admit I'm a Digimon fan. <laughs> Yeah, stuff. Um... Honestly, I think Digimon is a better series overall than Pokemon. I still find both enjoyable. Like, both are still enjoyable series, I just think Digimon has a higher standard of quality than Pokemon. Because when you think of, like, if you picture Digimon game in your head, Odds are you're thinking of something completely different than the person sitting next to you. Digimon has tried so many different things that it makes every, like, Digimon experience kind of fresh. Like, you don't know what systems they're going to use or bring back or how they're going to, you know, mesh with each other or whatever. It's really, really good, honestly. This game actually kind of sort of makes me think of Digimon World 1. Uh, I've... I am, I'm a bit sad of the upcoming Digimon game, but... Yeah, I keep seeing shit about Survive. Um... I keep, like, wondering what exactly it's gonna be. The Digimon games I've played are World Dusk for DS, World Championship for DS, and then Cyber Sleuth and Hacker's Memory. I think I watched the original Digimon Adventure. Lord knows I've watched the movie. Concerning amount. And we all know what a cinematic masterpiece the Digimon movie is. A single bit from Hachiko. Thank you very much. Yeah, a penny. It's more than I usually get. <laughs> all right. I've played Digimon World 1 through 3 in the Digimon card battle game for PS1. Some of the- a lot of the later Digimon games are really good, honestly. Do I have any fossils to flex with? Cyber Sleuth games are fun? Yes. Championship- I played a bunch of Championship, like, this past week. Alright, let's flex on this Maiar. I'm gonna play Digimon eventually. Please do. I know- I'm- I'm sorry I just, like, dumped, like, several paragraphs into your DMs. Uh, but I, I, I was hyper-focusing on it for, like, that entire, like, span of, like, three days. So I just wanted to, like, get it out of my system. Come on, baby. Clean cuts, clean cuts, clean cuts. I didn't mean to, like, give you an entire damn essay, but it just kind of ended up what happened. Clean cuts, clean cuts, clean cuts. Clean cuts, baby! Oh yeah, that felt good. Also, if you're wondering how you collect monsters in this game, for anyone that has not seen a Spectrobes game before, you dig them out of a rock! Maybe I'd get into Championship better if I ever tried it again. You really should. It's a good game. All I know about Digimon is the story of how someone's parents supposedly divorced because of the weird short that played before the Digimon movie, also the one for bait Digimon. <laughs> Clean ass cuts, honestly. Sup one minute, too. On such an oblong uh, spectrum. 
I think the divorce story was just a joke about how weird and unnecessary Angel Anaconda. Yeah, that was that was really weird, and I don't understand why they had it. What I like about the two Digimon games I played is that they have you taking care of the Digimon, which is like, which is what I want Pokemon to do. Yeah. I don't doubt that it's fake. Yeah. I don't know. The Angel Anaconda thing's honestly like a coin flip. Uh. Yeah, that's what I like about Digimon. Digimon has, like, two branches. Like, very... Like, it actually does have two branches. There's the Digimon Story series, which is focused on, like, the RPG side of the series. And then there's the Digimon World series, which is focused on, like, Monster Care. I haven't played this Spectrobes game. I don't think it ever came out in the UK unlike the previous two. I'm pretty sure it did. I think it, you just might have, like, missed it. Also, you've played the previous two?! <laughs> Finally, I found another Spectrobes fan in 2020. Oh, wait, this one needs an Earth one, doesn't it? Yep. It's a good thing I checked right here. <laughs> I, I guess we can pull out Gores. <laughs> Whatever the hell- who uses Gores in Origins? Let's, let's be honest with ourselves. Like... Like, who looks at all of the available Earth Spectros? A hundred bits, look at this little man dance. Oh, yeah. He's dancing. What Spectros? <laughs> okay, Cosmoki. Imagine finding a Spectros fan in 2020 by any means other than the technicality of turning someone into a Spectros fan. All this Digimon talk makes me want to play Next Order again. Uh, cheap friend, yeah. Uh, that is, uh, Zora. Anyways, uh, who, like, who, who uses Gores? Who uses gores? <laughs> Who uses gores? That's that's my entire question. Who uses gores? All right. Oh boy, it's this puzzle that I always like have trouble with for some reason. I have not played Next Order. I thought about picking it up. Chad gores, no. I've thought about picking up Next Order. I just like haven't gotten around to it at all. Okay, so... Yeah, I need to go through there, I believe. Yeah. Imagine if you could just, like, clip somewhere, and you could just, like, skip this entire section. Like, god, that would be very busted. I'm sure there's, like, some text somewhere. Oh, this is a, this is a battle room. Yep. Chad Gores, but it's just Ernest Kalamov. I do not understand that reference. Sheep, yes, Sheep Friend is very good. Alternate Palette, uh, Adult Zora, which I can't remember the name of, is also very good. I'm very sad that they removed custom, like, uh, custom colors and origins. Like, they... <laughs> that app was supposed to be an exclamation mark. Next order is pretty similar to Digimon World 1. One of the main differences is that they have two partners. Okay. Yeah, look at, hold on, I can pet. Hey, little one. Yeah! Now let's bring out Gores. Gores makes weird noises. Hey, little one. <laughs> Go. Oh! <laughs> Gores. Ernest Kalamov is the freakiest looking human being alive. A Slavic model with the world's squarest chin. Oh, that guy! Oh. <laughs> I like his little shuffle. I like his little shuffle. Gore sounds like a caveman on the verge of nutting. <laughs> Do with all the grayscale pictures? Yeah. The sheep can be pet? Yeah, everything can be pet. Hey, little one. Look at him. Here, we'll, we'll even pet uh, Cutie Pie right here. Hey, little one. Yeah. You can even pet the adults if you like get them in the incubator. It's great, actually. Up. It's about time. Yep. Yep. Neil. Why is Neil? I mean, he's funny, but why? Why is he? Just in general. Um. Is there a switch in here? No, it's just this room exists. Oh! I like Gore's noises. You can even pet the final boss. I do. I. I mean. On a very, very technical level, you can pet Crux. 
Yes. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and, like, get through this room. I mean, you can't do it in base gameplay. You have to, like, hack him into a spectrobe slot, but you can pet the final boss. It's technically possible. That's kind of what our boy, uh, Glunkus is all about. He's the guy that hacks this fucking game to fucking kingdom hell. I already used fuck in that sentence, so I can I couldn't say kingdom fuck. It would be redundant. Yeah. This is a video recording of the final boss being pet, and that's all that matters. Yeah. <laughs> Basically. Have you tried, uh, have you tried petting Darkrow? Darkrow is technically the final, final boss of this game. He's a secret boss. Wall. There is no point to this room. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot that there's literally zero point to this room. Other than to fight. Honestly, I can never remember if Darkrow exists for long enough to try doing anything with it. <laughs> Just fucking, like, write it on your arm like fucking Jailhouse Lock. Super boss. Oh, yeah. Didn't, like, Kino just, like, blaze through the fucker? Alright. Uh, let's see if I can remember how to do this. Uh, hello, wait. Yes. Wake up from a fever dream with Dark Row carved into my arm. Yeah. It's like fucking Memento. You just have like a Polaroid of Dark Row. Yes, uh, Dark Row is the secret final boss of this game where first you have to beat the base game and then you have to do a boss rush of every boss excluding the final boss, I believe. Uh, can I see the rotation? Time to do today's drawing prompt. I'll still be here lurking. All right, enjoy. Okay, so now I need to go all the way back up to the top of the fucking thing and go get the earth weapon. Oh, hey, I recognize this game. Real? How am I fi suddenly finding so many people that know this game? <laughs> If it were just a boss rush, it'd be fine, but they make you backtrack through each and every planet to the original boss rooms. Oh, yeah. That's always the fun part. Alright. Gores, do a funny little dance. Yeah. He did it. How? Well, because you introduced me. Oh! Oh, okay. No, wait. I just connected two and two. Hello, Octi. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize that was you last night. I genuinely didn't. What's that? Maya Lance? Yes. Alright. Yeah, Lance. I'll never use it. Dance for us, Gores. Good job. You did a funny little dance. Hey, little one. <gasps> Lances are very useful. Shut up, Lance Simp. And now I get to go all the way back down, do the red one, and come all the way back up, and then I can finish this. God. Gaming can confirm. As you can see on your screen, there is gaming occurring. Look at- I like- look at this little shuffle! Look at this little shuffle of gores. Look at him go. There's a battle in here. If the room is longer than usual, you will fight something. Oh good, they're in the air, my favorite. Show them what's good! <laughs> Bonk! Get his ass! Get his ass! 
Yeah! Every day Gore shuffling. He's he's fucking schmoovin. My favorite combat mechanic, female grunting. Oh yeah, baby, there's plenty of it. All the grunting you'd ever need. Hey. Pepe! <laughs> And now we ride. <laughs> uh, hey, anyone that knows about this game, after I get Pagatinum, should I just immediately make a beeline for Mount Awakening and get a Gokozoa? <laughs> yes! <laughs> just a fucking immediate answer. Do it, oh lord. Oh, I like that the fucking, like, that arm, like, pulls in. Like, no, you have to do the other one. We'll, we'll, we'll swap back to sheep. There we go. Look at him. He's waiting. He's, he's fucking stanced up, ready to go. <gasps> God. I always mix up Zabatar and Zabacraw. I'm having a goddamn brain in yours and trying to find a Twitch movie auto-host list. Why, God? <laughs> Wait, Neil isn't here. That's not good. So. Hey, all right. I, I think the auto-host list is like with your recommended channels now, which is weird. I mean, it's handy, but it's weird. God, I, I open, I, like, I unlock my phone to look at my notifications and I just see a very stretched out, uh, blue spaceman from Among Us. Or what? Like, the channels you recommend when you're offline, there'll be like a little list at the bottom of the page. By the way, if you want to see what my offline page looks like, you can click on my profile picture. This doesn't sound like a setup for a boss battle at all. Oh no, it is. It totally is. You missed. There's gonna be a, like a really nice CG cutscene where we get to see the boss. This game uses CG cutscenes very, very, very sparingly. It's been so long since I've had to draw back legs. Rip. Oh, I found Jesus. That's buried. Oh yeah, baby. I feel like doing a bit of glitch hunting. Can you spare a minute to grab a level 30 adult form, charge it special without using it, then evolve it and see if it's special behave like Chesmans? Uh. <laughs> oh boy, it's Big Chungus. Like, you can tell. I keep saying this, but you can tell that they were trying to make portals, like a sequel to the Nana Euro, like system, and then they just, like, changed mid course. Uh. Where did they go? Over here. Because they have so many of, like, the same character models, and then I guess they just kind of, like, decided mid-development that they wanted to do a different system, so they just, like, tweaked it slightly. Because you have fucking Dyrus, you have Katetsu, you have fucking, like, Radice being the oldest stand-in. You have Grant being fully modeled. You have Crux still being the main villain. Oh yeah, this is a mini boss fight. I forgot about this. Uh, speaking of crawl, uh, oh wait, god damn it! All right, we have to kill a thing. That's the gist of it. They tried to steal him away for knowledge and money, but they failed. What if you wanted Nana Euro, but Disney said, "Haha, Kaio." I mean, Kaio is a welcome addition to the deep lore, but uh, Snake. Snake. Hello. And now time for the mini-boss music that barely gets used. Come on, show them what's good, show them what's good, show them what's good. Oi. Okay. Come on, baby. 
Oi! I can tech that. God. Get his ass. Oh, yeah, feel the frames. Ah! Oi! Attacked it! Please just kill it. Ow! Attack those. Hit's done or something. Come on, Chesman! Come on, Chesman! Get his ass! Ow. When did I become an Eevee? You tell me. Uh, you can- Oh no, Chesman! Uh, okay, we're, we're swapping in. We're swapping him in, boys. Get fucked. Okay, no, I'm the one getting fucked right now. Listen, we have to save Chesman's life right now. Come on, Don Giga. Ow. Come on, Jungus. Ow. Okay, you're just not being nice. All right, finish him off, Chesman. Yes. Chesman with the clutch, though. Alright. Yeah, we killed the thing, and Neil's back again. Main tech is literally on screen. Give me mod power so I can ban this filth. Uh, not when you phrase it like that! Oh, I forget where the door is here. Uh Oh, it's over here. Go. Yeah. Have we chats with an iron fist says the trash bag. So what's the strat this run? I don't have one. I am just not using Zazanero as our carry. Stratus video game, yeah. Yep, there's the entrance. There's the entrance, yep. Wait outside. He's not going to, you know it. I- 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 I'm really thinking Chesman's gonna be our carry this run. It's gonna make Bombwood, like, very, very hard, but, you know, sometimes it'd be like that. So this is tolerable with emu controls now, by the way? Yes. Uh, for some reason, my controls started to work. Go. By the way, everyone, if you want, like, a visual interface for changing your avatars, there's one below the stream if you scroll down on, uh, desktop. On mobile, there should be, like, a stream avatars button in the top right corner of chat. Uh, I have Gens 1 through 4 Pokemon. I have a bunch of Kirby. I have some pixel art of Smash characters, if you're so inclined. Uh, let's see. What was I gonna do? Alright. Let's flex. Extra content, baby! Yeah! Alright. Watch this clean cut. Cleanest cuts in the business, I think. Oh, yeah, baby. Just, uh, give me that, give that a close shave real quick. And I fucked it up. Okay. 
That was a bit too close to shave. Uh. Oops. I mean, if I speed run this hard enough, maybe I can still get an A. I'm probably gonna get a B though, because I'm bad. B for bad at video game. Come on, what's holding me out here? What's holding out? What's holding out? Yeah, I'm getting a B on this. What's holding out? The little, little fucking lick on his fucking ear? I see a green has immediately opted for Sans. Uh. B for best streamer? No. That sucks. I've become Chad. Chad Wheelie? Oh boy, a singular mineral. Thank god. Alright, time to redeem myself. B for green lab coat. Ah, yes. B for Basans. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, we're gonna have to go for this strat here. Hey, that was a bit better. Alright. Fuck! Alright, we're just gonna drill it the rest of the way and pray. Alright, we can we can still get an A on this. We're st we'll st we can still we can clutch this one. That wasn't that bad, honestly. Now, if I fuck up with the drill, then it'll be bad. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good, baby. Seeing this game in a real resolution is doing things to my brain. Oh, hey, I still got an A, though. Yeah, I know. Having upscaled textures and shit is nuts. I mean, you should see portals with upscaled textures. It's absolutely fucking nutty. A all right, Pepe. This will be easy. Easy, Pepe. Let's go. All right, check this fucking shit out. Uh, let's place that perfectly. Look at that. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh baby. Look at that. Clean as hell. Yes, the uh Desmond does upscale. Uh Melon DS can increase internal resolution, but it doesn't upscale the textures, which is the important part. If you don't do that, all the textures will still look crust. It's just that you can see the crust. Newer in this case, still being pretty old, yeah, basically. Because Desmond doesn't get updated ever. Alright. Do we I'm gonna boost Chesman. He deserves it. We gotta boost our boy Chesman. Alright. Let's go in and pet him. I like how Desmond doesn't have an updater built in. Oh yeah. It makes it really hard to find the right nightly. Look at him. There he is. I'm gonna pet him. Hey, little one. Yeah. <laughs> Update machine broke. Hey, and he's, he slides even further to the right. Hey, I just one. pet him on his hand. All right. And when you pet them, they follow you for a bit, and it's very cute, and I love them. Look at them. Yeah. Hey. Hey, special attack. Unfortunately, programmers aren't interested in making anything that can be used by anyone else. Nope. Hey, Leal. Hey, little one. She says the leafy dragon is taller than her. Yeah. He's a little one in our hearts, damn it. I did not mean to hit that button. Alright. Uh, 
And now we train him with gear. I never understood how to use Kiptos. Like, are you supposed to use the one that's their type, or the one they're strong against, or weak against? I, I still don't understand. Like, I don't know what the hell I'm supposed to train him with, so I just kind of throw everything at him. Go. Do it. Spoon! Yeah! He leveled up, though. Okay. So now, what is grass strong against earth? So let's use the earth ones. Highlight my message 100, write something special up below, and give it some glitz in chat. Yeah, boy! And do that, you did. Cactus Dragon seems kind of like a prick. Oh, yeah, baby. I'm going to make the same joke every time. Spoon! <laughs> Seriously, does it only work on the thing that it's the same type as? Or is it just like it's a higher chance? I don't know how Kiptos work in this game. I have not known, and I will continue to not know, after this 11 year mark. I like how he just kind of stares at it. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Look at the power. <laughs> look at the sheer energy. You want to match type? Really? Is that actually how it's done? Look at that. Zua crossed. There's a younger Chessman. There's a Zenny... Is any Pyra, I believe? There's younger Chesmond. Fuck it, use them all. Chesmond baby photos, I know. And look at that. Look at the sheer energy. Look at how raw that looks. It just looks like he's ascending in place, and it's just God is making wind swirl around him. Use them all? Sure. We must boost Chesman with everything we have. If Chesman dies, we're fucked. You realize this? Like, does it only boost level if it's the same type? Or is it just like a much higher chance? Wait, I have a clear one. Why am I not using that? Also, the clear Kiptos is really pretty. Look at that. Yeah. It's a better chance to boost level if they're the same type. Okay. Go. And clear is gonna be like neutral. Look at that! The sheer energy! Yeah, there we go. Okay. God, it is so weird seeing this game in a resolution. Look at him. I return with Cheddar Season Popcorn. Welcome back. Pretty sure it's just a higher chance. I'm pretty sure. Anyone wants my last two chicken tenders? Oh, absolutely. I will take your chicken. Then your, I will take your tendies. I ordered Popeyes last night. Uh, I did it on stream, even. Uh, I ordered Popeyes last night, and uh, I ordered them mild. Uh, it took like an hour, and they got here spicy somehow. Um, it was not enjoyable. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I am extraordinarily white. So, make of that what you will. Uh, hold on, let me delete the... Let me delete this. Look at the raw power that this shows. I'm white as Discord light theme and I love food that hurts. I'm Celtic as heck and I love spicy pain. Fair. Delivery adds extra spice. I had to get it through DoorDash. Because I'm a sane person. Alright. We have three more. 
what if each and every one of these leveled him up? Then he'd have his bonus ability. That would be great. Alright, let's see. Go. Eat Street? What the hell is it? Eat Street? I like that he has to, like, stance on it afterward. He has to, like, be like, yeah, fuck you. Also, uh, just a reminder that I ported, I actually ported the, uh, this incubator into VR chat. Like, that's a thing I did. You can, you can be here in VR chat. I even added the music and everything. Sheer alpha energy. Oh, absolutely. Chesmond is an alpha. Are you kidding me? Go. Incubator 2 is greater than Incubator 1. Kind of facts, but this one has a special place in my heart. I literally do not think that other Kiptos can do things, but, you know, it's worth a chance. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, I meant to grab a drink before starting the stream. Oops. What if Grubhub were pronounced the other ooh sound? Grubhub? Oh, yeah, baby. I would buy a lot more from Grubhub. Rip VR chat, I'm selling my Oculus Rift S. Uh, for good reason. Yeah, none of the things other than plant and clear leveled them up at all. Alright, do I have, like, any good amount of minerals? Uh, yes. I have a substantial amount. Alright. There, we left him his fucking trail of breadcrumbs. Look at him go. Skill issue. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. <laughs> Just slowly leading him. This is how I this is how I win. This is how I train them. In GDQ, this is called donation time. <laughs> This is what I call something that doesn't happen in the speedrun. Because you can just barely get by without using minerals if I'm remembering correctly. I think that's what Gary said. Come, back. Come here, bud. Come back. D d Hello? Here, take one. Yeah! <laughs> Up 38, alright. Attack, 100 even, nice. We got $5 from Mike Hawk. Thanks for the $5, Mike. Yes, I know what I said. You feed him rock any levels up, sounds legit. I mean, they're literally fossil. Uh, I would like to explain a fun part of the deep lore of this game. This series in general. Uh, the way that new spectrobes are born is that when the adults, like, die, they fucking explode into fossils of children. That is legitimately what happens. I think that is stated in the webisodes by, like, Kate or something. I know it's stated in the webisodes. Uh, I just don't remember by who. Yeah, uh, whenever, like, whenever an evolved form reaches the end of its lifetime, it just fucking explodes. It fucking explodes into fossils of its children. It's great. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna save real quick. Well, I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, basically. That's essentially what I'm implying. Also, I need to rewatch the webisodes again. Also, also, I'm going to try to run an ad while I grab a drink. Let's see if I can do that. Please. Uh, for some reason, my stream deck does not like. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Hello, slideshow. And we're good. Okay. Yeah, whenever I open my browser, uh, Streamlabs doesn't like it. Uh, dashboard. This. Alright. 
I'll tell you what I'm going to do. We're going to run a 30-second a ad break real quick. Just while I, like, dip to grab some, like, a drink. Because I meant to do that, and then I just fucking didn't. BRB dying real quick. Imagine not being seven, having to learn about Travis Scott. How else would you learn about the Fortnite burger? Alright, we're gonna run an ad thing. Here we go, boys. missing some banger content right now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Standing quadruple backflip. I literally ran off and was not on camera. <sighs> Travis Scott macaroni night. It's macaroni night at the commissary! Alright. Uh, so that's ten minutes without pre-roll ads. That's pretty good. My bitrate's steady. That's good. And now I get to close my browser. Okay. Welcome back to video games. Uh. Oh yeah. Uh, Chasmond. Okay, now we can do this. I'm just gonna waste it just for the f fucking spectacle. Spoon. Why the fuck did you go over there? What the hell is happening? What the hell are you? Move. 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 Also, why is she suddenly issuing recalls? You say that like spectacles? A waste? I don't know what the fuck you're talking about why did you go over there because you told them to <laughs> over there go. oh look at this map oh baby oh this has one of the rotating rooms fuck it's like a messed up version of the oxus you can be a normal version of Deoxys for the low, low price of one entire dollar. <laughs> if you buy it on stream avatars. <laughs> if you reach the end and don't have the right spectro for the elemental door, I will yell. Why are the two of the switches just directly next to each other? You really missed out by making Mantag free. I could have scammed you out of like 20 bucks, honestly. <laughs> if we're being fair. I could have gotten an easy 20 bucks out of you just for Mantag. That'd be like four Travis Scott burgers. What is it with you and Travis Scott Burgers? Also, I just got two Kiptos that I can use on, uh, on Chesman, so that's very good. I hope I get more of them. Mystery Pod! It's gonna be a mineral. Hey, I'm Travis Scott, and this is my McDonald's order. Follow me. <laughs> this is a regular fucking <laughs> double quarter pounder, except it has bacon on it. Oh. 
Yay, open. Who's ready for the worst puzzle in the fucking game? The rotating room. I'm switching, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, I hate the rotating room with every ounce of my soul. Nope, can't get on that side. The worst puzzle is trying to figure out where this game falls in the timeline. I mean, it clearly has to fall somewhere after portals. Because it shows the three portals during the opening where Grant is addressing the MPP. If I, if I remember correctly, the solution to this room is so fucking stupid. You have to have at least 200 I 2,000 IQ to understand this room. I'm gotta, you gotta go. This was fun. All right, thank you for coming. By the way, I'm glad you stopped by. Um, the magic of renaming in this six times, so we can call a little bit of time item. Thanks, Mr. Scott. Yep. Thank you, Travis Scott, for putting bacon on a burger and calling it an entirely different fucking burger. Um, I do not remember the solution. Hold on. I think there's only like one, like one actual spin of this where you can like get there yeah um so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna come over here okay that actually wasn't that bad now that i actually turned my brain on for this fucking puzzle um now i just have to wait so how's it going? How's it going, chat? Y'all having a good day? <laughs> it wasn't even hard. Look, I'm just stupid, okay? I do not have... I don't have, uh... I don't have wrinkly brain, okay? Hello, Gors. Um... <laughs> Oh, I hear it, I hear it, I swear to god. Get fucked, Cosmo Key! Light clockwork, yep. Go. I have the right type, fuck you! Go. Do a flip! Yeah! I don't understand why they made uh, sky type purple for the pedestals. Unless they were going to be the dark spectrum. No. I mean, they could have been. I don't know. I don't know what the beta of this game looked like. Except for, like, you know, tutorial screens. The zap laser, I believe? Optoblaster, right. Ah, yes. One of the five weapons, I believe, that is based on a card input spectrum. If I'm remembering correctly. Also, I need to go in and here and press this button. I guess I just didn't do that. <laughs> Plonk. We're already an hour in. We're not even... <laughs> We're only almost done with Menahot. Like, what the fuck? We haven't even fought fucking Zabatar yet. The ruin section is so long. Alright. <laughs> Give me stuff. Oh boy, another fossil to flex with. To show you the power of flex tape, I lasered this fossil in half. Oh yeah, this! I forget that there's just a puzzle where the solution is the, a fucking smiley face. Here, we'll use Gors for it, because why not? I totally forgot about this. So. <sighs> so. I, I totally forgot about this. <sighs> Come on. Yeah, smiley face. And 
now we can keep playing the video game. <laughs> Bridge. Is this the end of this section already? No, there's a battle room. How could I be so blind? Why would the game let me through a ruins without a battle? Let's be honest. Yeah. Watch this. Spoon! I should have saved that for Zabatar. I'm dumb. I don't have a thing that's called, a uh, foresight. What? <laughs> the ancient spectrum's master thought, what if we made the puzzle smile? I'm just gonna go ahead and send over Gores. Oh. Yeah. All, all six things. We need to do the shit. Okay. Go over there, Gors. What if we made the smiley? Hey, he just takes fuck. He just takes a fucking seat. He's like, my work's done. Go, go, gadget. Cutscene. Hmm. That was a useless thing. Uh. Yeah. All six things. Now it's time to do the plot or something. Time to fight a big fucking fish. It's almost time to see a CG cutscene. Oh. Oh. Yes, we have to go to the thing in the middle of the place. Go to the ancient lock. Yes, I'm aware. Look at him go! The shadows are on, like, a different layer of the ground. Look at that. The backside doesn't, like, show, like, the softened edges. So it just looks sharp. God, this game is well made. Uh, I'm actually gonna do this. Oh, oh, oh. All right. I just need orbs. I need orbs. I need the orbular. Fuck off. Fucker. Get me up. Oi. Get his ass. Another one. There we go, all right. Bust a move, all right. Orbs acquired, now he can spin on Zapatar. Like, if you can well place fucking Sabaquil's, like, super, it's nuts. Also, who's ready for a voiced cutscene? This is it, last of the famous mechanisms. <laughs> Isn't this just the most awesome of all awesome things? 
Exploring old ruins is like the coolest thing in the whole Omniverse. He's like a six-year-old. Let me press it. Can I please? Oh, please, 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 please. And oh. But why not? Basically, she's saying this is sort of a Rollin job, Neil. No. What I'm saying is, I got it. What? But why? Everyone here acts like a two-year-old. I can't believe he just did that. Get down! Uh, uh oh. And Neil is just completely oblivious. <laughs> Bye, Neil. <laughs> His model shrinks into nothingness. It's incredible. I know. It's just, I mean, the things that can be right under your feet without you even knowing it. Eh, here it comes. <laughs> I told you, oh didn't yeah. I? I said it was gonna be awesome and long. Awesome, right? Sure. It's totally I like his little fucking steps that he has to take to get out. Anyways, I tested my hypothesis about Chesmans and I was able to completely legit Spectrobe. Oh! So that's just a thing that happens. Cool. This is me trying to explain Spectrobe's lore to someone. Ha 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 Alright. Trap for the big fish. Trap for big fish. If the DPS were better, I'd say it, it could help the speed run. Ah. Uh. Alright. Hypogatnum. Alright. Go away, Neil. You are no longer needed. Ancient device seven. <laughs> Show me forgetting him. Day he is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no turning back. Whatever. Awaken it. I planned on it. Uh, let's excavate. <laughs> it might be viable with a projectile spammer like Gokazoa. Maybe. Juicy. Oh yeah, true iframes. All right, let's flex. Let's just get this mineral out of the way. I know it's gonna be a mineral. Yep. That was a pretty clean cut, if I'm being honest. being crux fight easy win oh my god purple yay I, I might just drive a stake through this one's heart out of like spite watch this excavation Precision! Right in the corner. <laughs> right in the corner. Alright, now we'll actually try. <laughs> I still need to get uh, Gold Kamainu on my like actual save. Like the one that I use in my own fucking time. You know, when I finish my save on my own fucking time. Uh... This one's gonna be a bit sloppy. Oh lord, where is it still connected? Where? There we go. Fuck! 
Yeah, this is a very sloppy job. Oh lord, I don't want the scanner again. This is an extremely sloppy job, this is totally a B. Yeah, this is definitely a B. onto his feet slowly. What? Oh, barely. And there it goes. <laughs> I mean, if we if we revived him, he could ult like out of the gate, but I don't care. Um I would rather wait until level 40 to get a uh, Gokazella cuz then I could immediately res it into having regen. Alright. Here, we'll go to Incubator 2. We'll go to Incubator 2. Day he is! New mineral. Wow. Yeah. No, I never mean to actually hit that button. Incubator 2, Pog. Honestly, Incubator 2 is very, very nice. I like the, like, the rainbow haze around the island. I like the rainbow haze. Alright. Let's do it. Sorry, bud, you don't get to take a nap. It's gamer time. Hit him with it. Please level up. Yes! Alright, he has his passive. Let's go. What? Oh, it's 45! 40 is just a level up of the strong attack. Damn it. Also, apparently there's a level up of the strong attack. For some reason. Uh, I don't understand why the... The strong attack has tears? But you know what? Whatever, man. Did he just lay down again? No. Go. Hit him with it. Level him again, please. Damn it. Alright, at least he's level 40. Alright. Poof. Gina appeared in the void very briefly. Alright, Chesman, you're gonna carry us to victory, bud. God. Save. Yes, keep playing. Who's ready to say hi to Begatnum? Trick question. Damn it. <laughs> I like how they're chatting as if they're like looking at it. You're like, you're facing the wall. Oh yeah, look at that focus. Touch, touch. I don't like how the Rollins' eyes bulge so far outside his head. It worked! Oh man, this changes everything! We're in business, Gina! 
Hello, Zabacraw. I think it's dumb that Zabacraw and Sabatar both have different names. Let's go over the plan one more time. Yes, he's in he's in uh, Rollins' favorite crater. Uh, and then, yep, that's the plan. All right, who's ready for a CG cutscene? Right after this one. After it shows us the thing that doesn't matter anyway. All right. The switch is undone by doing the thing. All right. CG cutscene. Damn it. Well, are you ready? Or do you want to This is not a CG cutscene. It's next. Let's go get some crawl. And there they go. Why doesn't the game let me fly in the actual game? Okay, now it's CG cutscene time. For real. Look at the quality. Zoop! <laughs> he got nuked into orbit. Ha, bye, Zabacraw. Too, but at least at least what motherfucker you may have done zap craw but zabatar is still in there bud yeah what in the day he is not again some guys just don't know when they're beat all right it's time for zabatar I always forget that each boss crawl is an individual mu music. Alright, it's time for my favorite part of the fight. Uh, walking in circles. Um... Zavatar is just... It's a fight. No! Jasmine! <gasps> Fuck! Stop moving, bastard! Oh my god! Okay. Spin! Yo! Holy hell! Okay, actually, hold up. I need a better weapon. Uh, do I want a sword? Fucking... <laughs> Jesus Christ, Jasmine! Um... Do I want a blaster for this? Or do I want a... Like a sword or something? Honestly, I think blaster might be the play. Actually, no, wait. Blaster to flex on bosses. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna switch to Chung. Okay, let's go. We're gonna switch to Chung. Wait. Oh, fighting Zabatar is not fun. This is not a fun boss fight. And that's why we switch to the Chung. Do I do I seriously wanna fine, I'll do a lance. any lance to make red happy all right please just become vulnerable again all right
Hey! All right, Chungus, get back out here. Okay, let's go. Price ball spam time. Oi! God. It's avatar fight, not fun at all. This is just kind of tedious. This is like the second worst boss fight in the game, Fascagardos. Damn it, okay. Nope. This really is just like the second worst boss fight in the game, Pascagardus. Oi! I swear to God, just be vulnerable. Well, I'm just gonna stand still. Whatever. We got a cheap shot. Where the fuck are you going, Chungus? Please, I am begging on my hands and knees. Oi! Really? Okay, now you're just fucking with me. Okay, maybe Blaster is the play. Jesus Christ. Considering I have so little time to react, I might as well shoot him at range. Lance. Listen, Cosmic Keys had to do it. Yes! Alright. Finish him off, Jasmine! Oi. Oi! What the fuck? Let me. Let me up, let me up, let me up. Get him! Get him! Get him, Chessman! Yes! Okay, I just knocked my headphones off my head. Cool. Money. Chessman with the saves. And now it's time to get another piece of our Bionicle. Get the shard. Have you ever thought about how the pieces of Kayo look like pieces of a Bionicle? I have. A lot. Day he is. Oh, look at Shimainu. <laughs> When did we learn about a long time ago? This was ground zero in the great chrome war. Oh yeah, baby. Power. The sheer awesome power of the ultimate form. That's what saved the ancients. A miracle. Is that so? And it's said that it will never rise again. Not unless compelled by the threat of dire catastrophe. I think that is the thing that's happening right now. Lovely audio we're having. So the worst, impossible as this is to imagine, must be yet to come. Hmm. And he just exposited this aloud. I can no longer wait for some ancient. Sin. Oh hi, Grant. You're also there. Yeah, it's an ultimate form. How did you doubt this? It's catastrophe, but not really dire. It's like he's trying to ha hide what happened. If we if we can't trust the commander, who can we trust? Huh? Yay, memory Shimainu. Give me the fucking MacGuffin. Give me the MacGuffin. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Mm. 
Yeah, more pieces for my Bionicle. Both, I, I think you have competition now, Glunkus. I have notifications on Twitter, hello. Lost in the sands again. And who has they chosen, chosen to, to vex me sleep. with... CHILDREN! And, and yet, clearly not children. <laughs> My favorite line from Crux. Like, you have to think about this. This isn't actually Crux. This is just Giotto playing up, like, Hamish cartoony evil. Yes, I know how Begatinum works. Woo! Awaken your awesome power! Yeah, Crux would never say that. He's not that blatantly evil. As you can see in literally every flashback in this goddamn game. Hi, Neil. Yeah, we're back. Slayso! Oh, yeah, baby. It's Slayso time. The expansion cube. Oh, no, it's the blueprints. But hey, it's the card machine! Really? They're gonna make Gina run ahead? Ew, I have to play as Roland! Ew! 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 DS Link. I can't do that because I'm on a completely legitimate Wii that somehow lacks DS functionality. How do you yeet skillfully? Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, of course. Fuck it, forgotten him. You know where we're going to go? Literally anywhere that isn't Slay So. <laughs> Card input machine, yeah! Time to bring. <laughs> Time to bring up the wiki! Woo! Oh yeah, who's ready for this? Um Card input pog champ, let's go. Alright. Let's see here. Cards. Just, uh, put my browser over here. This article is a stub. It really isn't. Show me portals. Alright. Uh, so what do we want to go for first? Items or spectrobes? What are we feeling? Cat girl Gina, of course. How could I be so blind? Uh, let's see. Oh, fuck. Uh. We don't have a scan of Gem Sword Ass. I need to look it up. Oh, no, wait, there we go. Okay. Okay. No, 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 no. 
Hey. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. Uh. Okay. Now we'll get super mineral. Oh yeah, we did get a scan for super mineral recently, didn't we? Funny weapon. Soup mine roll. This is what we're going to be doing for like the next 20 minutes, by the way. Absolute speed! There it is! Chesman Super Mineral. Oh, absolutely. He is definitely getting the Super Mineral. Um, let's see. What do we want next? Oh, we gotta get all the other minerals. Or do we want pajama? Oh wait, no wait, hold on. You dropped this king. <laughs> I did not mean to close out. Uh, also, I didn't actually get cat girl Gina. I got magical girl Gina. Fuck. Uh, first off, let me switch back to Gina. I got gem sword. I didn't get the cat gloves. I am dumb. I am Bobo the Fool. Yeah, alright. Back to this. Because I didn't mean to exit out of the menu. Circuit board. Cat glove. There we go. Do we seriously not have, like, any kind of scan for this? Spectrobes, Origins, Card, Input. Uh... Go, go, Gadget Game Facts. Ninja Blast returns them in the Tyler Ninja Blevins. Yeah, probably. Uh, Cat Glove. Two, zero, four. Nine, one, two. Five, eight, six. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, I, E, A, B, C, D, H, L, P. Fuck! I did it right, though. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J. So, J, I... E, A, B, C, D, H, L, P. What the hell? Oh, I'm just right. I'm just reading the wrong fucking thing entirely. Um, cat glove. Wait. Just highlight it for my fucking convenience. Okay. J I E A B F J L M J K L M N O. Yeah, I can't fucking read. Let me just grab the attack mineral since it's like right here. Since we actually have a fucking scan of that. And also it's easy. Attack Juice Man Cosmo. Bye! <laughs> um, okay, so 650 110 743. Oh boy, you want to see how hard this one is? Bam. Oh boy, 
boy, what a toughie. Alright, let me go get Ninja Blaster, because it's like the only other one we don't have to scan for. What is it? Gem Sword, Drillance, Catlove. Okay, actually, we need like a bunch of these. Do we at least have like the thing for the Drillance, like on the wiki? No. What about the Ninja Blaster? No? Okay, cool. Wonderful, thanks. Uh. So I can at least scroll down. Right now we're focusing on just getting items. Seven, three, four, eight, zero, seven, five, two, six. Watch this. Damn it, I thought that was the right one. Uh, okay, uh, Drill Lance. E a B C D H L P go. Drill ants, yeah. All right, let's get fucking big chungus giga axe. Giga axe. Nine seven six. Seven 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 eight seven four. There's just fucking warfare happening in stream avatars right now. Okay, so F B C G F J K G H L K O P L God. I will now proceed to never use this fucking weapon because I hate axes. Um God, there's just fighting happening. What the hell? Just be friends! Uh, okay, so we gotta get X of the uh, Ninja Blaster. Two funny number. Zero, two, five. Two, zero, three. This is content, right? Exclamation point, be friends. Please. F E I J. F G H L K G Ninja. That's all the uh, fancy weapons. Let's get all of the normal ones now. Or all the galaxy ones at least. Zero, one, four. Wait, do we have scans for those? I believe we do. Yeah. We have scans for all of these now. Okay. Yeah, because we were having trouble with what? The Galaxy Axe? Okay, tell you what. Let's do this on the top. Okay, so six, seven, nine. One, four, two. Nine, six, four. When I actually have the visual, I can tear through it like no one's fucking business. Look at that. It's a little it's a little shark. It's a little shark sword. Alright. It's time for the lands. You better pay attention, Cosmic Key. You better have this technique perfected. If you don't have the way to get the galaxy lance memorized, then what are you doing with your life? Look at that lance. That, that's actually a very pretty lance design. Uh, okay, axe. Zero, one, four. Zero, eight, 
Three, three, one. No, not that. Boo. Hi, hi, Clay. Uh, we're doing all of the card input right now. Uh, I don't know what the axe is supposed to be, honestly. Um, it's the chat bubbles for me. Um, okay, so now it's Blaster. One, three, four, nine, zero, three, one, seven, zero. Damn it. Speed! How dare you attack me? Why is that spinning fast? Why is the Galaxy Glove spinning so fast? What the hell? Okay, now the Galaxy Blaster. Okay, oh yeah, the Galaxy Blaster looks really neat. One, eight, three, six, three, one. One, nine, zero. God. Spoon! Look at that. Why is it spinning so fast? Leave me alone! Alright. Uh, that's it for the weapons. Now let's get the other minerals and then we'll be done with items. Alright. We got the attack mineral. Let's get the guard mineral then. Two nine five, one two eight, zero zero nine. Easy. Finally, some respect. Yeah, hearts. I thought we were miss still missing the Galaxy Axe. No, we got a scan of that. Either way, we had, like, the raw input anyway, so... We knew the inputs for it, we just didn't have scans of the card. Uh, 953... 3... Fuck. 3... 1... 6... The fucking steal in the five, the movement is canceling the bomb. Rocket jump! If you really want to be ballsy about getting your fives, use bombs only. Um, okay, so I think that's all of the items, yeah. Okay. So, do we want all of the scan the card spectrobes or only like the unique ones or do we want to get certain palette swaps uh i'm thinking we grab a uh, skull zuacrid and we grab blood spikenor and alternate Z zaka blood or shaka blood as well as the five originals how about that Okay, so let's do, yeah, constellations. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Shut up. Uh, so zero, one, one, two, three, five, eight, one, three. That's just a vent Pokemon. <gasps> go, go, gadget, flamer axe. There's no alt color for Don Giga, yeah. Hi, Flame Rex. Uh. <laughs> Q. 
cool. My ears are ringing for no reason. Uh, what do we name it? I have no shame. Let's be honest, who really, like, remembers Misuzar? <laughs> Highlighted. Really? Who remembers Misuzar? Let's be honest. Damn it. There we go. Only I ever named Respectro's Pokemons. <laughs> like, who really remembers me, Suzar? Let's be honest. He's just kind of here. No, you're not Raikou. That would be Octogre. Uh... Uh... What do, what do we name him? Florida has gators. Who really used any of the card-only spectrobes? Uh, I don't fucking know. Cause, don't they like start at fucking level 30 and you're supposed to be like level 40 at this point in the story? Anyways, time for fruit salad. Highlighted warfare in the chat boat today, honestly. I'm just gonna go for the obvious. Time for Skarazuk, I guess. Also known as Totally Not Villainox, we swear. Give the series back to Jupiter, man. Honestly. Jupiter knew what they were fucking doing. They really should have. They should have just had the Vilar line, dude. Gun bug? Oh yeah, it's a gun beetle scarab. Alright, it's time for the most recognizable uh, card spectro of Octogre. Kind of dumb. You need the spectrobes, yeah. Oh, sweet. Give Spectro a name. All right. Do I go for the Raikou joke or do I name it like something good? Opto God. Looks like the lion whore from Pokemon? What, Pyroar? Actually, I can kind of see it looking like Zamazenta, if anything. 
Mixed with Fury Bait number six from Mega Sun and Moon. We'll, we'll name it Opt God. I legit. Should I raise Opt God? As like a backup to Chesmond? Dragon Zero Aura. <laughs> um. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Are there any alternate palettes we wanted to grab real quick before I move on to Slay So? Transrite Zora? Oh, you. I. Skull Kamainu? <laughs> Comparing Octogre to Zamazenta makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> Fair. Um. Are there any other palettes we want to grab? I mean, like, I could grab, like, alternate Shaka Blood or Blood Spike and Ore or something. Or Homestuck Gorbarus. Past few seasons have had legendaries that just look like Leah's are. True! Uh, Skullzua Crit is also very good. Blood Spike and Ore would be good. Yeah, I figured. Get Skull Kamainu and then evolve it. No. Hecking Homestuck? Yeah, there's just a home. There's just like a. There's just a color palette swap with like a Homestuck thing. And it's very uncomfortable. I'll grab Blood Spike and Ore. Alright. 4, 6, 3. 6, 8, 7. 5, 0, 2. Where is he? Right up there next to Uptoger! How about that? Alright, um... Yeah! There's Blood Spike and Ore! Look at him! Holy shit, he looks so menacing upscaled! Get Homestuck, man, and make him the most powerful creature. You don't have to get Homestuck Gorse now just to show it to your friend. You know what? I'll do it. I'll get Horms. I'll get Homestuck Gorbaris just for the fuck of it. One five one four two two nine eight three. Blood Spike and Nora, baby! <laughs> Why are you attacking me? Okay. Oh, yeah, this one's like a weird shape. It's like perfectly square for some reason. There he is! Homestuck Gorbaris! Mind you, that Spectro was normally, like, fucking gray. Spikenor looks good in red. Yeah, but I think he still fits better as an Aurora Spectro, but he doesn't really fit the fire Spectro motif. You should have named it Gamzee. Yeah, but Gamzee isn't one of the Calio brothers, so it doesn't matter. Alright. I think we're done with card input. The real question is... We need to swap. We need to swap up our party now. Also, I'm getting a headache. Um. So that's fun. So there's Entei. So yeah, they all spawn in at level 30, which is actually better than a lot of our team. <laughs> How about that? Um. So we have a grass, so we don't need salad. Uh, we're gonna bring in Optigod. We're gonna bring in blood. I wish I didn't have to swap out Flux, but just for the sake of like team comp. Uh, fire. I mean, we can swap in Entei. I mean, it's better than Monkey, so fucking whatever. Atari, um Sure, I'll just I'll just swap in all of them. 
<laughs> the real question is, do I put in Gunbug or Homestuck? What what what's the consensus here? Gunbug or Homestuck for my Earth? Uh, Homestuck is a ranged. I think they're. I mean, they're both ranged. This one's literally a fucking gun. Uh. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. These guys have three tiers of strong attack? Uh, neither leave Don Giga B. <laughs> I'm sorry, Clay. The consensus is Gunbug. Unless, uh, Cosmaki has something to say. Or Aubrus. Joe, thank you. So I guess Aubrus is the con the confirming vote here. Should we put in Gunbug, Homestuck, or leave in our current Chungus? This is the, it. All comes down to you. I patiently await your response, Gunbug. All right. I'm sorry, Clay. The people have spoken. Um. So that leaves our team as Chesmond. Uh, Vilnox, Optgod, Florida, Entei, and Blood. Holy hell. Alright. So let's put in... We'll swap these two around. Like, what's our order of priority here? I think I want Florida in the back. I always just keep my my spare, like, back here. So we're gonna put in Optgod in the front while we buff up Chesman real quick. Phone was in pocket, then gloves left fast. Fair. Yeah, my mom made me chicken. Alright. There it is. The one and only super mineral. Come back. Hello. Do we give it to Chesman? Or does someone else? Go. Come back. Does someone else deserve the super mineral? Or do we give it to our boy Chesman? Hey, little one. Give the king the crown. You're right. How could I say no? All right. Take it all, bud. God, our boy Chesman. Do we have gear? I don't think we do. Yeah. Now, I don't have any good minerals, so that... What I was about to say was it goes out the fucking window. Um, do we want to grind Opt God? I want to catch up on uh, Pagatinum weapons anyway, so we might just, like, go grind Opt God. Training montage. I think that's what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna go grind Op God while I uh, clean up on weapons. Oh shit, I never took Chessman out of the incubator. Um. <laughs> that was almost catastrophic. That's the wrong menu. Hello, Shimainu. Hello, Shimainu. Fuck off. Um, there we go. I didn't mean to press that button. Nah, we'll, we'll leave Shimaini as a fucking fossil. Alright. Let's go ahead and save. Save. But you're currently at two hours. So we'll go to about another half hour or so, maybe a little bit more, and then we'll swap to Beat Saber. And then I get to go eat chicken. That'll probably be cold, but you know. Ah, finally. Good. Commander! Commander, Grant? Commander 
Where in the world have you? That can wait. There's a matter of far greater urgency to discuss. What about it? Sir, I mean you can't deny it's been highly. Roland, you're gonna have to trust me. Time is short. Hey, I need these JPEGs of Grant immediately. <laughs> I forgot that like the crawlosphere threat like started so early. Sure? Commander, about this weapon you mentioned, what exactly do we know about it? When does Rawling get the macaroni? I don't know. Except you have seen it before. But why would that be? Has any intelligence come in on that? And he's gone. You there? Commander! Not again. Gina, get him back. What's the matter with this equipment? Just when he could have told us something useful. When does Rolling get the macaroni? He'll never get the macaroni. Maybe they mean Daidongu and its macaroni horns. Brandon would be proud. Oh hey, Ex a flashback of Grant doing experiments on the crawl. Strange fluid. Yep, it sure is. A c very clear shot of the crawl goop. Me when strange fluid. What the? Why does that? I'm gonna have tea. Amazing. It actually generates crawl. What happened? Uh, no, my uh, my blaster went off. Oh, good. You had me worried there for a second. Yeah, that that crawl had some fucking pearly whites. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll be outside if you. Why is that crawl not dispersed? By the way. It's not enough to work with. Not if I'm ever gonna figure out how to use it against them. Hmm. Just a reminder that Grant was a fucking scientist. Just in that last cutscene alone, there were so many contradictions from what happened behind the portals. Oh, please do elaborate. I would love to see more and more plot holes in this fucking game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have to go to Weeterra. Next stop, we Terra. Uh, I don't think so. Good lord, okay. Why do I have so many messages on Discord? I can close this tab, or this window entirely, actually. I did not mean to click back into we Terra. Um... We're not in a wheelchair. I'm fucking. Uh, I'm in the hot. Uh, we're going to Dildogo. Just from the crawl sphere being unknown, Roland and Gina distrusting Grant for any reason, etc., etc. Yeah. I thought you were talking about the flashback scene, although I'm sure there's some shit there too. Like, it's never elaborated upon what actually happens to Crux's body. Like, does he just, like, fucking pound the fluid? And it just, like, starts being generated by his body or something? This game is an alternate universe from the original two games. Dino was right. Oh, God. Crux body, go squish. These are some theories that would make fucking Dragabond very happy. All right, time to be annoyed. Oh, oh, oh! All right, fuck it, we'll do it. Oh, oh! 
Oh, these are very low level, actually. Well, actually, that makes it very safe for Op God. How do you play like again? Oh, yeah, that's right. Bad. He has way too much wind up. Gore's nut dot wav. Octogre is so shit. Only when it, like, everything is around it is it, like, good. Yeah, the hitboxes are not... They don't exist. Oh, hey, an attack mineral. Chess been eating good tonight. Holy shit. Or do we, or do we give that one to Opt God? Yeah, his standard attack is absolute garbage. Chesmond, alright. He deserves it. Chesmond needs the best. Chesmond is the best, are you kidding me? Oh! Oh! Alright, let's let's give Op God another chance. Okay, so Octogre is a spectrum that would really benefit from Don Giga's stando power. Go. But the thing is, passive abilities are only active when that spectrum is on the field. What's a strong attack? I don't know. I thought I I tried to do it, but it just didn't. Unless I'm just dumb. Yeah, I can just I can get on Pagano at this point. Woo! I like how the only like open-ish planet that utilizes Pagatinum for a weapon is fucking, uh, Kogo area. Because Doldogo is all dense forest, and the two planets after... The two planets after getting Pagatinum are both indoors. It's Slayso and Bombard. Torgalance time. To be frank, you could get some broken shit if you could have every ability open at once. Oh, absolutely, but that would, that would be the fun part, though. That's kind of, like, what you want out of a single-player experience. You just want to break it to shit. Doesn't matter. Super armor, healing, damage cut, attack defense plus 20, berserk, and the Torga lines ability. Oh, lord. I want everything to be absolutely busted. I'm assuming that's like a base game code check, but if that was just like a thing you could do in Geo where you could just like give one Spectro multiple abilities, that would be absolutely fucking insane. But that's probably like hard coded in the game. I already got that marker. Whee! Whee! I always forgot to, like, grab this weapon whenever I play normally. Because I never think about coming up here. I don't even know what this weapon is. What the hell are you? Zenny Glove, or the Zen Glove, or Tatsu Glove, whatever. You'd really only need the super armor attack defense boost, really, and probably healing everything else is gravy, yeah. Imagine not knowing every weapon, fuck you. Um. 
To be frank, I know very little about how attack values work, but those share the same pool of values and abilities. It could be possible to set the less used attack values to be abilities and have them actually work. True. Then again, I would know jack shit about this game. All I know is that I found some tutorial screens by just raw digging through the files and spending a lot of time on it. Just memorize the locations of every weapon in this game. I essentially have. I know the locations of the markers. I just remember. I just don't remember what's where. Are there weapons in Triple Falls or uh, whatever the fuck it is? The little, little pond. I don't think there is. Although I could just be like dumb. Or do, do what I do and only grab the weapons of a single type for shits and giggles. Why do you hate yourself? Zooming. I like that Pagatinum doesn't even like stand on the ground, it's just floating at all times. Do you think you could do triple falls clip on- Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Because Earth Monotype playthrough demands it. Oh lord. <laughs> Monotype and fucking Spectrobes? Why? Why do you hate yourself? Serenity Woods, that's what it is. Can you do triple falls clip on Pagatinum? I mean, I know you can like summon it after the fact, but... Actually, hold on. I'm gonna save first, just in case I do something stupid. How close was I? Damn it. Save. Yes, continue playing. We got him! Yeah! Triple Falls! Come on, let's see a fucking finessed ass Triple Falls clip. Alright. I don't think you can do it on Pagatinum. I think it's just because, like, just because of how- yeah, there we go, look at that. Fucking easy. But now I should be able to get back on Pagatinum, yep. How far out can I go? Whoa, fuck. Oh, you can see the- Jesus Christ. Hold on, how- how far out do I have to go to get around the loading zone? Pagatinum too thick? Yeah, Pagatinum is too dummy thick for the loading zone. Like, I genuinely think that's the reason. Where am I on the map? I'm not, is the answer. How far back does the loading zone extend? Because I know you can, like, hit the back of the loading zone. Also, wait, if I... I can't swap off of Pagatinum until I'm back in bounds. Also, yeah, my, my, uh, my Wiimote just has very sticky keys. Or, uh, buttons. I guess I can hit the back of the loading zone, whatever. Freudian slip, shut up. I, I I think it's sad that you can't, like, back warp through uh, loading zones. Like, it would put you on the other side of the loading zone. I think you can't do that, it's done. How'd you sticky your keys? Uh, gamer. Gaming, lots, lots of fucking Doritos. Doritos and Cheetos and sour cream and onion, baby. 
All right, let's let's see if we can see Op God's strong attack. Does it just not have a unique strong attack? I keep trying to use it. Tell it to do anything. Damn it. Uh, that's not the lock on that gets you the strong attack. I know what lock on I need, and I did it, and he was still just swinging. Oh, hey, a life mineral. Holy shit! Chessman eating mad good tonight! I tried both types of lock-ons and it didn't work. Maybe they like misplaced an attack value or something? Stream avatar smile. Brandon deleted his account again. Boo, can't you spaghetti him in the village? Boo. Dodoko's fruit. I don't want to know about that. Why the fuck did he delete it this time? I don't know, man. Brandon does as Brandon does. Alright, I think we can go clean up on Kogo area and then we can stop for the day. For Spectrobes at least. Swap to Beat Saber. Also known as get literally one weapon. There is only one weapon locked behind Pagatinum on this planet. Shaka Axe, yep. Brandon is Chadman. Yeah. He is. Brandon is Big Chad. Shaka Axe. Real Chads have beaten the Spectrobes game. <laughs> Let the man live. Glacier Valley. Yeah, lost memo. Ooh. Consider the following Chesman emotes. I mean, you still do owe me emotes. Uh. Go. Go. As per our arrangement, you do owe me fucking emotes still. I feel kind of bad for Brandon with how much he roasted for his inability to complete one of these games. Yeah, it, I do feel bad for him a lot of the time. Because we just never let up. I feel like that might get to him sometimes. I do. Yes, you do. Rice balls! Alright, forgotten them. And I have my drawing tablet back. Yes, I know. You sent me a picture of a possum in a beach chair. Woo! Shaka Axe, baby. Yay. Another weapon that I'll never ever use. Imagine using axes, hello? 
I thought, uh, I thought that was another life mineral for a fucking second. Don't gig a hammer better. Axes are fine. Are you sure about that? Imagine if you could just, like, go back into the crevice. Crevasse. That's the sound of me wiggling my control stick back and forth on my wee nunchuck. I, I can't... I can't take Pagatinum through the cave? Okay, I can. I, I'm just bad. Let me out! Let me out! There we go. Imagine being a beta and not using axes. Crevasse. No. It's a crevasse. Dead Spectro pretty. Oh yeah, Pagatinum... Pagatinum is unique. Pagatinum is a special boy. Anyone remember Spectro? <laughs> Stop. What Spectro? I'm kind of tempted to port uh, Fawn. It sounds weird. I want to port Fawn's satellite into VR chat. Begatten and be pretty, though it's the only non competitive Spectro outside of the child forms. And technically the ultimates, but like to a, uh, to a lesser degree. Oh, hello, mouse. I'm sorry, I mean a uh, Wiimote pointer. Alright, we Terra. When character design isn't enough. Alright, do we go ahead and see Radice? Or do we do we go to Mount Awakening? The mouse you're referring to is Mickey, of course. port the top of Slice. I actually was! That was another one of the maps I was actually planning on doing. Like, no meme. Ugh, game like that. Oh, pit stop. Okay. Damn it. I did not mean to press that. I forgot this had homing. Oh, you bastard. Literally, Optoger is better without me commanding him. Optogod is literally better when I don't tell him to do things. Okay, actually that was pretty clean. It has two it has two hitboxes. Okay, that one was pretty clean. For some reason. He just did it to fucking prove me wrong. If you port Fawn Satellite, we can have creepy anime girls and creepy scary avatars running around at sacred halls. A hard no from me. Combat grunting to electric gruntaloo. Oh yeah, baby. Okay. Actually, instead of doing either of the things I mentioned, we're gonna swap to Beat Saber. Um, save. No, do not continue playing. If we don't get enough grunting from this game, there's always the Beat Saber segment. Exactly, see? Glunkus knows what's up. Oh, so the one time I, the one time I do mean to press that key, you don't want to show it? Okay, bud. All right. Who's ready for my grunting? Oh yeah, uh, my n my Nintendo Wii is updating. I forgot about that. Okay. So uh Beat Saber. All right. Let's go ahead and shuffle this around. And actually, can I Oh yeah, Crust Mike is kill. We have we have done away with Crust Mike. Nope, Crust Crust Mike is no more. Stream manager. Uh, 
Let's see. It's gonna run. All right. We're going to run a two minute ad break. Or actually, no wait, we're gonna run 90 seconds, a minute and a half. So while I get all this ready, we're gonna run 90 seconds of ads. Here we go. Hey Google, turn on the lamp. Welcome back, everyone. Uh, one second. Let me just uh, set my shit down. Audio balancing should be fine. Let me check if the VR audio is actually coming through before I get in. It should be. I hope so. Must have missed the front flip. Rip. Sucks to suck. Listen, I do all kinds of acrobatics when people aren't looking. That's how I roll, honestly. Okay, let's just... Anyways, yes, we have we have done away with the evil of Crust Mike. Crust Mike is no more. All right. Also, mind you, we're playing online queues now in this game. into the fucking void! <laughs> Again. <laughs> a 
Apparently, God does not like the lack of trust, Mike. Apparently, or Facebook, the Almighty Zuck. I guess we can do a single player run. Also, I'd like to mention that uh, mods seem to be integrated now. Um. Like, what can I play without getting copyrighted? Uh. What, what can I play without being copyrighted? That'll get me bend and banned in Denmark. Uh. Persona 4 music. Sure, why not? Since we're here, you know. Literally everything is, like, not going good. How do I keep doing this?
I've missed two notes. attack me when I'm vulnerable. I've never played this map before. Way no, fuck you. That's a no for me, Chief. Hey, you want to see what torture look lo looks like? You wanna see what torture looks like? I was subjected to this in online. actually. Nice. I want to be somewhere nice. That would be quite lovely right about now.
I'm sweating like hell.
press somehow. At least I'm fucking over my friends. All I need. Whew. What are we looking at? I think I can fit in one more song. Does it want to work? Hold on. Does it want to work? mistake I make.
hello. Oh god. Oh. I am fucking melting. My arm is literally fucking ready to snap off. Okay. That's gonna be it for today. Get your fucking slot rolls out. Get them all out. Nice try. Um, that's it for today. I will be on tomorrow night for Sunday stream. Um, I should be on next week as well. The week after that, there is a solid chance that I will not stream as well as a couple weeks after that because uh, moving. So, yes, thank you. Super six on my fuck my sleep schedule not for me to show up tomorrow. <laughs> Rip. Anyways, thank you all for coming. Thank you for making today a good stream. Um, you know, I guess I'll see you whenever. Thank you for coming.